news flash for you guys. We are all responsible for our energy. We are responsible for how we choose to respond. We are responsible for the triggers. <laughs> we really are. I know. Um, I got to work on my triggers this week. Have any of you had the opportunity to do that? What a blessing, right? Ugh. <laughs> not always. It's not always. It doesn't always feel like it's a good thing. <laughs> Especially when you're like... <laughs> so... I am thanking the people who have come into my life to show me those things, those things inside that I need to work on. Um, I, I don't see myself as passive as far as, uh, I'm not somebody who's going to stand in the corner and watch something happen. I will come in. Mm. <laughs> that is my energy. So if you feel like that's good energy for you, I invite you to come into my life. I invite you and I encourage you. Um, I am a cheerleader. I am a protector. I am, uh, I am awkward. <laughs> I have my moments. Um, I do struggle sometimes with insecurity. Um, there are things where I'm like, I don't. Uh, but at the same time, my guides kind of, and I'm gonna find a meme for this or a gif or whatever that's called. But sometimes I feel like my guides push me <laughs> as I'm as I'm falling out into the street, running people over. It was that gentle nudge, <laughs> or maybe it wasn't so gentle, <laughs> but it was a nudge from my guides, like, you go do this. And I think the reason for that is even in my uh, my insecurities and, and my occasional doubts and my worries or whatever is going on in my own life, I think it's important, and I think this is the reason um, that I'm doing what I'm doing and why my guides keep um, pushing me is because we all have these and it doesn't make us any less. We will look at other people, like uh, if, if you look at Hollywood, for instance, or a lot of these self-help gurus, they're so calm and so patient, and everybody's like, oh, I want to be like that. But at the same time, you already are. You just need to know that you have your own special gifts, and you don't have to be perfect to succeed. You don't have to be perfect. You don't have to be like that person or that person or this person or this. You have to be you. That is where you're going to shine is by owning your truth, by bringing your gifts to the world and sharing them, not by hiding in the corner or secluding yourself or thinking you're not good enough. Um, that is an underactive ego, underactive um, self-esteem. There was a time in my life where I literally didn't feel like I should be seen. I would hide in the corners. Literally, when I met people, I didn't think I was good enough to be in their presence. I'm here to tell you that is false. False ego. That is not the truth. And I know that now. And that's why I'm out here uh, um, being silly, being goofy, being off the wall and corny. And who is this person? It's me. It's me, Melissa. I'm here. I want you to know and I want you to experience how amazing it is to receive that love. And connecting with spirit has changed my life in ways I could have never fathomed or imagined. It has been surreal. Um, when I first started getting messages and I remember talking to my team, my guides and angels and saying, I cannot believe this is even happening. This is so amazing. And then my guide said, my guide James, he was like, but there's more, a lot more. And I was like, more than talking to dead people? You're telling me there's more than that? No. Holy heck, was he right? <laughs> oh my goodness, was he right? So um, there's so much more. Um, and while this page is a, a lot of what's on my page here is um, connecting with your guides and angels and connecting with your loved ones and spirits, so mediumship, psychic, spiritual. There's just so many things to focus on um, and so many things to learn. So that's kind of, this page kind of feels all encompassing to me.
I'm kind of like that too. What is that saying? Jack of all trades. I'm not saying I'm jack of all because I'm not of all, but I, I like to delve into different areas and different aspects. And I think it's amazing and it's important for our personal growth to pay attention to all these things that are coming at us and all these messages that we're receiving on a daily basis. <sighs> okay. So your newsflash is to be true to yourself and to honor yourself. And that's why I did the news thing because I thought, okay, that's kind of fun. Let's do that one. Because <laughs> it's usually kind of boring and I just... Uh... You have a special gift. We all have gifts and abilities that we are to share with the world. That is where your power is. Owning yourself, loving yourself, no matter how awkward you are or how goofy or how quiet, or how loud, no matter what that is for you, you own that. You own that because that's when you find your tribe. That's when you find those who are meant for you and your message. All right, I send you guys love. Have a fabulous Friday. Thank you for being here, and I will talk to you soon.